For the first time since 2009, the Iowa State football team is guaranteed a winning season. The Cyclones picked up their seventh win of the season after defeating the Baylor Bears 23-13 on November 18th. The Cyclones' success has fans and Ames buzzing. Oh, this has been a great season. I'm, I'm really, really proud of, of the team, the players, the band, our, our daughters in the band. Um, and uh, I'm really looking forward to the next uh, several years. They have a really strong, strong way to go. In just his second season, Coach Matt Campbell has taken his team to prominence not seen in Ames for over a decade. Well, I think Matt Campbell's, Campbell's proven that uh, he's, uh, he's the real deal and he's going to go out and we're going to refill the ranks and just... Uh, I'm really looking forward to uh, the years to come as well with this coach. So Iowa State was ranked in the AP Top 25 poll, something they haven't done since 2005. Campbell and the Cyclones also earned five Big 12 Conference victories. The last time that happened, a guy named Seneca Wallace was quarterbacking the Cyclones. Manning takes the snap. He'll throw it. If you ask the coaching staff, however, they'll tell you it's Iowa State's senior leadership and their perseverance that is changing the culture. You know, Iowa State has meant so much to them, and, you know, they have given so much back and, and really have given more of themselves, and that's what we always talk about is, you know, are you willing to give more of yourself than you take? And this group of seniors has been tremendous in that regard. This group uh, has done a tremendous job of, of really taking change by the horns and um, really becoming... I don't know, I think the voice of the locker room. After enduring three losing seasons and a coaching change, Iowa State's 22 seniors are finally enjoying success. The thing I've been most proud about is about the adversity that we've had the first three years and not having the success and um, accomplishments that we, that we wanted to have here and to be able to go out and on those two big wins at, at OU and having TCU here. Um, um, I think those are probably the two, two biggest points of the season that just um, solidified uh, Marcel Spears picked it up, and the Cyclones have the ball. The Cyclones aren't content yet. They're hoping to do something that Iowa State has only done three times in program history. They want to bring home a bowl victory. For ISU TV with Les Moiriccia, I'm Ben Olson.